Talia Tran is in the house. She is an actress extraordinaire. Oh. She's Reina in Little. Yes. There's billboards all over Los Angeles right now. How are you feeling about that? Oh my gosh, I just got back to Los Angeles. I just came from Savannah and I came here and I was like, whoa, on the yeah. drive up here this morning, I was like, there's so many posters and it's amazing. It's hard to believe. Right. So yeah. tell us, what is the film? So Little is a comedy about this uh, mean and narcissistic and selfish businesswoman named Jordan who gets trapped in the body of her 13 year old self. And so she has to figure out how to get back to her adult self. But meanwhile, she is forced to attend school where she meets my character, Reina, and the other kids of the friend zone. And we're kind of the outcasts of the school and she tries she tries to make us cool you know by like, pretending to be different people but you know we learned that it's best to always be yourself uh, <laughs> yeah. that's a great the moral, moral story. Yes. Sure it is uh, what do you love most about your character Reina? oh Reina, well, first of all the outfits are absolutely Amazing. crazy uh. and fun <laughs> because um my character Reina was she's categorized as an outcast because of her uh, her inability to choose her clothing wisely. Ah. And so there's like a chicken outfit where she has like a chicken purse and that's all fun. <laughs> but I think what's my favorite part is that we get to be part of a movie that's not only hilarious, but tells a great story mm -hmm. with a great message. So. I love that. So tell us about your journey. There's lots of people, lots of, you know, teens or whatever that would love to be an actress or actor. Yeah. Tell us about your personal journey. Well, actually I didn't start in acting. I started in music, so I didn't grow up in a household with a lot of art, you know, my family doesn't come from that type of, you know, artistic background, but ever since a child, I've always been super creative and I loved music mm -hmm. and I started singing from a very young age and my parents were like, oh, that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I, I guess so. And so I started vocal lessons, piano lessons, guitar lessons, I started composing music. And then one day, my vocal coach said, hey, you should try out some acting lessons to improve your performance skills. And I was like, uh, okay, I'll <laughs> give it a try. And so I signed up for a lesson, and I instantly fell in love with it. Mm -hmm. And I was like, wow, this is what I want to do. And I kind of, we've been just push, pushing forward, you know, because when you love something so much, you just put your heart and soul into it. And I've been very fortunate, and I'm so grateful to mm -hmm. be given these opportunities. Mm -hmm. What yeah. is about mm -hmm. acting that you the most passionate about? What part do you love the most? Well, first of all, I love that we get to tell stories, you know? It's like reading a book, but seeing it all come together and right in front of your eyes, it's just magical. Mm -hmm. But also, it's really cool, you get to explore these characters that exist in kind of these fictional universes where different things happen, you get to explore what, what if this happens, or what if that happens, and I think it's just really cool to imagine. Yes. So is there a dream role you would love to play someday? Mm -hmm. um, I've, <laughs> I've always wanted to play a superhero. I know, like, everyone always says, oh my god, I want to play a superhero, but I, I really do. What would be your superpower? Mm -hmm. I don't know, I'll take every superpower. I'll <laughs> yeah, take every superpower. <laughs> I'll take it. I don't know, I just think it's cool to be living in that universe where, you know, anything is possible. I've always loved fantasy and magic, and it's just cool to imagine yeah. being part of that universe. You're a testament that you actually do live in that universe right now, mm -hmm. isn't it? That's right. It right? is just like, it's really magical. You know, I wake up in the morning, and I'm like, wow, I'm just living the dream. How did you become so positive? Is your, is your parents like that, or how was this, just, are you born <laughs> like that, or have you had to work on that? Um, I think that having that support network that is always encouraging me is really, really helpful. Mm -hmm. And the one thing that keeps you going is hope, and you've got to keep that in mind. And they always say that if you want something bad enough, you'll get it, mm -hmm. and you'll work hard for it, but you'll get it. And so my parents have always encouraged me to work my butt off <laughs> <laughs> and, and just like do what I love, you know? Well, what advice would you give to kids who want to pursue a career in entertainment or the arts? Yeah. So. The entertainment industry is obviously really tough. You know, people will say no to you. They'll say they'll, they'll criticize you for just about anything. Yeah. And so it it definitely takes some confidence and some courage to be going into the industry and putting yourself out there and saying this is what I want to do. And so I think you just have to say that this is what I want. You have to know with your whole heart that you're going to do everything that it takes to get there. Mm -hmm. Because if that's what you love, that's what you love. And nobody can change that and nobody can take that away from you. If you have that passion, you can pursue it and you can become successful mm -hmm. with that 
courage and heart oh, and positivity. Oh. So, so we've, been, we've been talking about enriching people's lives, and if you want a rich life, you've got to enrich others' lives. Who's enriched your life? Obviously, your parents oh or God, so yeah. many people. Anyone in particular that you'd like to give a shout out to? Well, I know my sister has, mm. she's the best little sister in the entire Aww. universe. I love her so much. We were like this close, and she just makes me happy. I wake mm. up in the morning and I see, I see her, and she, she's just so positive all the time. I think that's what also keeps me smiling as well. Mm. I thought for sure you would mention me. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> I know we just met, but it's okay. It goes without saying, Rob Mack. Okay. Yes, obviously. <laughs> okay. Definitely. That's so a given. Awesome. Uh, so tell people where they can follow you, and of course, they can find the movie out there. I know that. Yes, one, yeah. it's coming out April 12th, and you can follow me on Instagram at Talia Tran Official. T H A L I A. Some people miss the H, but T H. Oh, thank, you awesome. so thank you so much. Thank you so much.